Hey guys, um, I'm, I hope you're doing well because, um, guess what? It's a Mac haul, right? I know, right? Look at this. Look. This isn't a normal Mac haul. This is a special limited edition packaging haul. And it's called Liberty of London. So I'm excited to share this with you guys today. So, yeah, Max newest collection is called Give Me Liberty of London. And if you don't know what that is, um, Mac collaborated with the designer Lib Liberty of London who makes, um, they have like certain designs and stuff on their items and they collaborated with Mac and they have really cool limited edition products. So I thought I'd share this with you guys. I actually got this stuff Thursday, but t today was the first chance I had to record this. So uh, took the SATs this morning. So that kept me pretty busy this week, so but now I can finally share it with you guys. Unfortunately, some of the items in this are already sold out on the website, like five, I believe. So it's selling out fast, so if you want some of the stuff, like, go get it. Go to, like, your, go to the nearest Macy's, Nordstrom's, Mac store, counter, wherever you can, if you want these, because they are selling out. So, if you could see see the packaging is like white um i don't really have a plan for this so i guess i'll just kind of go one product at a time um i will start with the nail polish there's the packaging if you can see it has like black and white little black designs etchings of like flowers and berries and cute little things like that little colored leaves and stuff. Um, and on the top it says Mac and Liberty of London in gold. And so yeah, they had two um, nail lacquers in this collection. The other one was Blue India, which is this um, pretty dark blue color. But that is unfortunately already sold out on the Mac website. I know, right? So if you want that blue color, <laughs> good luck finding it somewhere. And if you already have one, then <laughs> Enjoy it, but I got the less popular one, and this is called Vestral White, and it is, of course, white. And if you can see, there's the bird on it, which is on most of these products in this collection, this cute little bird. Hope you can see it. It's, it's, little, it's holding, like, a flower in its mouth. I think it's so adorable. <laughs> um, so, yeah, that's Vestral White. I don't know what else to say. It's white, but I, I liked it. And I was looking for a white nail polish, so there we go. All right, so I guess next we will go to blushes. They had two in this collection. One was like a dark plum color called Dirty Plum, but that was way too dark for my skin tone. Um, it would make me look like someone punched me in the face. So, so I went with Prim and Proper. There's the blush packaging. Same, you can see the birds, the colored birds, which are blue little designs and stuff. Yeah, so I got prim and proper. And there's the packaging. Glassy, clear white plastic little case. Yeah. Um, with the bird on it. And this is a very neutral color. Um, like a bronzy yeah, that color. <laughs> um, I guess I'll swatch it. I'm wearing it today. I kind of use it as like a bronzer today. With um, yeah, nothing super outstanding, but I I liked it and it worked better for my skin tone, better than the dirty plum. So I thought it was pretty. So there's the swatch right there. I hope you can see that. Um. So yeah, just a, a very pretty color. I didn't have anything like this. Um, I've just mostly had pinks and stuff so far. So it's a pretty neutral color. That's prim and proper. All right. Next you will go to beauty powders. All right. So there's the packaging. Huge this thing. Design all over it. Ah, look at that. Oh, so cool. Just the box just looks so classy. Everything in this collection looks so special, and it is, so it's awesome. Okay, 
Oh, and if you can see, on the inside of all the boxes, they have this repeating flower design, like the blue, orange, and yellow flowers. So I thought that was cool. Very detailed packaging. So here's the beauty powder packaging. Kind of raises up a little bit. Um, so I got Shell Pearl, and there it is. Very pretty peachy champagne-y color. Um, this is my first beauty powder, and I must say I really like it. It's just very, very soft. Just like so soft and silky. I'm wearing it today on uh, as like a highlight on top of the um, blush and on the nose a little bit. And yeah, this one just adds a really nice, pretty shimmer wherever you want it. Um, you can put it all over the face. You can use it as a blush. On darker skin tones, it would probably just look more like a highlighter. But it's still very pretty. This, as well, is unfortunately sold out on the website. I know. So if you want it, um, they did release both of these beauty powders in past collections, so you may have it. Um, but if not, good luck finding one. Because, I don't know, they're very nice. Okay, so I will I'll swatch this. So nice and soft. Um, I do not know if you guys will be able to see this, because it's very light. But it's right there, beneath the prim proper blush, there's Shell Pearl Beauty Powder. Yeah, just adds a nice shimmer to the face. Glowy, y'all. Good stuff. All right, and the other color was... um. Summer Rose, which is like a really pale rose pink color, so, I don't know, I didn't like it too much. I guess, I guess some may like it, but it didn't show up very well. It, it was nothing outstanding. I mean, I guess neither is this one, but I just like that one better, so you can try them out and take your preference. Alright, all that I have left from this collection is lip products. I know, right? I kind of went a little crazy on the lip products this time. I was excited for this collection, don't blame me. Um, so I got, there were four lipsticks and four lip glosses. I got two glosses and all the lipsticks. One of them I actually got two of, so that's seven total. Okay. I will... I'll start with... Uh, I guess I'll start with this one. Alright, so here's the packaging for the lipsticks. MAC, Liberty of London and MAC. Cool. And this is actually like a sleeve. If you can see, you can like, you push it out. So that's like a cool little sleeve. And then there's a white box. And yeah, I loved every color from these. This one is called Peach Stock. And again, um, design inside the box. And this is actually a pro product, so pro people can get it whenever they want. But it would um, slip down to the um, regular consumers, so everyone else can get it now, so I tried it out, and I, and I liked it, so, yeah. So here is the packaging. It has the familiar bird, and all the little flowers around it. Very cute. Oh, I just love the packaging. It's like, oh, and it's white. It's just such a nice change of pace from all the black, and, <sighs> Limited edition packaging is so cool. All right, so here's peach stock, um, and it is a very neutral color. Um, it's kind of like the, almost like the color of the prim and proper blush, but in a lipstick form. Um, yeah, it's just a very pretty neutral. Here, I guess I'll swatch it. There it is, right there. You can see that. Very pretty neutral color. You could put a lot of stuff on top of this. Or just put it all over. It's just a all over lid color. Love it. Alright, the next one is Ever Hip. Ever hip. So, you know, same patching, I won't repeat that over and over. So this one is Ever Hip. And this is a cream sheen. Oh, Peach Sock is a satin finish so this is ever hip and this is a cream sheen and this one is <laughs> sold out on the website <laughs> I am sorry if you had this awesome if not go find it because it's awesome look at this 
Look at that. Do you see it?